Hello, my name is Thundercloud89, and before anybody starts chewing my ass off, yes, I know I haven't uploaded any videos like I said I was going to do, but some person lost my camera and it happened. Anyway, um, I said I was going to do movie reviews, video reviews, and game reviews, blah, 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 you get the idea. Uh, I was going to start off with Left 4 Dead, but I changed my mind because I'm saving the big guns for, like, later days. Um, I'm going to have... This time, I'm going to review Ghost Recon Advanced Warfighter 2. Yes, it's a long behind name. I know. It's, imagine saying it one breath and saying it five times. Anyway, um, the game is set 2014. Still fighting Mexicans like you did in Ghost Recon Advanced Warfighter. Um, you're still playing a Scott Mitchell. You still have most of the guns. And the storyline really hasn't changed. You shoot, You shoot first or they kill you. How about that? <laughs> um, yeah. don't ask what that was. Um, anyway. Uh, crap, I forgot what I was going to say. I just lost my train of thought. The game has multiplayer, but it's really weird. The first game had complete campaign co-op. This one has campaign, but you're not playing a Scott Mitchell. You're playing, like, these two little lower ghost agents. Or uh, I can pick up and wait. Go, go stage and go and go stuff. Um, personally, I love this game. I bought it for fifteen ninety nine. For fifteen ninety nine, at GameStop. Okay, I am so sorry. I'm not doing anything. It's just that my sister, she, her rat keeps getting out of her cage. So she has to like barbed wire it or something, and she's sitting there trying to be quiet while I'm recording, and it's not working out. I'm so sorry. I'm just sitting there laughing my ass because now she has to put the barbed wire on her foot. I am so sorry. I did not mean to do that. <laughs> sorry. Oh, all this is because of the rats. Anyway, um, <laughs> I picked it up for like uh fifteen dollars and odd number of cents at GameStop. Um. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Um, you should actually consider picking it up because it's a really, really fun game. And the, the, the guns are amazing in this thing. We have a, uh, I guess you could say it's a modified P90, I guess. Like, the stock is a P90 replica looking thing or whatever. And the, um, but the barrel it isn't. It has, I believe, a grenade launcher on it, and it looks really cool. But, to be completely honest with you, like, I'm going to, the way I'm going to do this review is I'm going to go good ass back gameplay story like that. Um, alright, one of the, uh, the storyline is what I already explained. God, I'm, I'm, God, I, I feel like an idiot right now. Um, the gameplay is good. Uh, it's a, it's a shooter, what do you expect? You, the, it does have a cover system. And, but it's not as good as, I would say, Gears of War, but you can pretty much put yourself up against anything, except for like a pole or something. But anyway. The badass fact about this game about this game is that the multiplayer is so different than it was in the first one. I mean you can't play a complete campaign together, which is really stupid. But it has verses and stuff like that. And it's too short. It is really, really too short. I beat it in like two or three days. I just that's just too short for a game. Um don't ask what that was either. Uh, okay. The the game, the gameplay is pretty good. The bad aspect is just that it's too short. And the ending makes no sense. They leave it open for a uh, for a third game, but Lord knows where that is. I'm not going to spoil the ending because if I do, I will get like three star rating or one star rating because of the spoilers. Well, if you don't like me telling you the ending, then don't listen to me. I'm not gonna say it, relax. Um, anyway. it's a good game for like a rental. I bought it because I was I needed a shooter. I needed a shooter other than Halo 3 or Left 4 Dead. So, yeah, that's pretty much all I got for that game. Uh, if you do have any other uh, things that I missed, put in a video response or a comment or whatever. Just There is one thing I have to say. I was uh, reading, I was listening to some Michael Jackson music, and I read this one comment. This guy said something so negative. Um, he said, I'm glad that child, uh, humping mother, 
is dead. Now, I'm not gonna lie about you. I'm not gonna lie about this. Um, I used to make fun of my professor. I used to make fun of him a lot of times, and I feel bad about it now because now I feel like a giant prick. But um, listen. Here's what I want you guys to do. Cause this is what I do for. Uh, this is what I'm gonna do for all my uh, videos and blogs and crap. What I'm going to do is uh. What do you guys think about? Well, what do you guys think uh, about Michael Jackson? Do you think he was a good person? Do you think he was a bad person? Do you think that he died? Do you think somebody murdered him? Do you think uh, crap like that? And listen, this is another person's opinion. So for those people who say that he was a good person, and you see somebody that says he was a bad person, don't write a bad comment. That's their opinion. Don't like be a giant douche about it. That's their opinion and stuff, so, um, this video is getting long, um, crapping stuff, when there's, I really want you guys' opinion, just don't rate, like, as a bad comment or a good comment, just don't, I mean, that's their opinion, anyway, I gotta cut it right here, there's been, like, 6 minutes, 11, 12, 13, 14 seconds, I don't really care, my next review will be a surprise, don't you hate me, anyway, this has been ThunderCloud89, comment, rate, and please subscribe.